Hello, I'm Carter Williams, Senior Product Specialist for Siemens Pilot Devices. Today I want to talk to you about our new Sirius Act product family. Sirius Act Pilot Devices retain their impressive IP69K rating without having to purchase an additional boot for the operator. While the IP69K rating makes the pilot device an excellent choice for the demanding washdown requirements of the food and beverage industry, Siemens Act pilot devices are suitable for use in applications utilizing NEMA enclosure types 1, 3, 3R, 4, 4X, or 12, with a panel thickness ranging from 1 to 6 millimeters. Siemens offers three different 3SU-10 operators only and 3SU-11 complete units in 22mm operator designs, as well as a 30mm flush design to meet all your application needs. First, there's a 3SU-10 or 3SU-11 black plastic bezel operated for 22mm operators. Second, the 3SU-10 or 3SU-11 mate finish stainless steel metal bezel with a plastic operator in 22mm sizes. Third, the 3SU-10 or 3SU-11 shiny finished nickel plated brass zinc die cast bezel operator in 22 millimeter. And in the 30 millimeter size, we offer the 3SU-10 or 3SU-11 in a flat mate finish. Additionally, we offer three 3SU-12 compact 22 millimeter devices with a monolithic body. All contact blocks and light modules are built into the operating body of the 3SU-12 operators, including the 3SU-12 black plastic operator, the 3SU-12 mate finish plastic operator, and the 3SU-12 shiny finish all metal operator. All of the devices in the Sirius Act product family share the same simplicity, durability, and ease of installation. Here are some of the standard features you can expect with a Siemens 3SU-1 series of operators. First, Siemens 3SU-1 operators do not require an alignment notch or keyway, saving you valuable installation time and cost. However, it should also be noted that the 3SU-1 operator can also be used in a mounting hole that does have a standard keyway and maintain its IP69K rating, making it an excellent choice for rework applications as well as new installations. Also, the seal created so tight that the operator holds itself in the enclosure while the operator is being installed. For example, just simply place the operator in the enclosure, then you can turn it upside down and it doesn't come out, making it a secure fit. The operators are so simple to install, the job can be done with one hand. The mounting screw comes from the factory preset to approximately four millimeters to save installation time and work for the majority of applications, but fully adjustable to six millimeters if needed. A single mounting screw secures the operator to the panel. No special tool is required. We recommend a size two cross tip screwdriver or a flathead screwdriver. The tightening torque for the holder is clearly marked on the holder for easy reference. Both the plastic and metal holders have eight spikes on the front plate of the holder to keep it from rotating. Siemens metal holders have an additional spike at the top of the holder to provide grounding when used in a ferrous metal enclosure. There's also a grounding hole provided for when it is mounted in a plastic or fiberglass enclosure. You'll also see that our plastic holders have been keyed so they will not work with a metal operator. However, our metal holder can still be used with our plastic operators to provide our customers with the maximum mounting security possible and omitting the need to stock two different holders. Up to three modules can be installed side by side without an adapter and single contact blocks are stackable up to two deep. Hook the narrow clip at the bottom of the module to the holder and then snap the top hook into place. Holders can be removed without having to remove or unwire the contact blocks and or light module, thus saving you time and money by limiting the maintenance cost and downtime. To help you design a custom enclosed push button station, Siemens offers a configuration tool at the following URL. As you will see, in addition to enabling you to design your custom station, the tool will generate a results report, data sheets, and enclosure details. It will also allow you to use the configuration identification number, or CIN, to enter your order without the need of saving configuration files. 
Once you've finished using the configuration tool, you'll have successfully designed an enclosed push button station that is capable of being submerged in water up to three feet without water infiltrating into the enclosure. And while your application may not require a pilot device as robust as our Sirius Act pilot device family, you can rest assured that there is not a better product to meet your application. Please visit our pilot device website for CAD drawings or data sheets to help you plan your next project.